Here's an overview of what my room looks like during the day. We have cute Hazel. I actually just got this rug, but she is in love with it. Hi, BB. Are you trying to play? <laughs> I'm gonna put this down. She goes up to it. Hi, boy. Good girl. Shake. Shake. Oh, good girl. Spin. Good girl. Do you want a treat for doing all that? I'll give you a treat. Here you go. Good girl. I'm gonna be doing this tour at nighttime because it'll look a lot cooler with the lights on and everything, as well as I need to go to Michael's and pick up some paints for this mirror. I'm going to be doing a TikTok where I paint it and it's gonna look super cute. So I'm gonna include that at the end of this video. So when you walk in, this is what the right side of the wall looks like. Left side of my wall, I have my pack system and I'll go over all of this, my mirror and then my closet area and then back to my door. I'm back. Let me show you what my room looks like with just the LED lights on. I feel like I'm an avatar sometimes when I'm in my room. This is the left side, yeah, so I love it so much. Okay, so now I'm gonna switch to normal lighting and we're gonna go through the tour. We're gonna start with the door. So this is where I keep my vision board. I keep it behind my door. I usually have my room door closed because I'm doing videos. So I see it almost every single day. And I'm going to be making a new one soon. Hell, I'm so short. Like the top of my door is like way up there. Let's see, hold on. This is where the top of my head is. Right next to my vision board, I have a sign that says she believed she could, so she did. And I purposely put it next to my vision board because, you know, manifestation. She believed she could, so she did. So anyway, next to that, this is my vanity. And then I have some LED lights. I found these two on Amazon. That's from Home Goods as well as this one is from Home Goods. This is from a party store. It's just a little flamingo. And if you follow my TikTok, you would know any flamingo that I have is named Craig. So there's another Craig over there. Here's an overview of my vanity. It's really big and I'm so grateful for it. My parents helped me build this. We basically took a big slab of wood and that's kind of what these vanity light things are screwed into. My desk is from Ikea. I have had this desk for like two to three years. It has a whole bunch of like dents and scratches. It's not very appealing in real life, but I get away with it in video. So I think I'm gonna keep it for at least another year or two. I really wanna get a desk that has like a glass top so I don't ruin the box. Bottom. Right next to my vanity, I have this thing from Ikea. This is where I keep stuff for videos. Like if one day I was like, I don't know what to do for a video, I would just come over to this shelf and be like, okay, perfect. I'm gonna do a haul or I can do whatever that's gonna be. I don't know why this is here, but it's a little, it used to be part of a necklace and now it's just kind of, I ripped it off for some reason and now it's just kind of chilling here. It's a little boba drink. <laughs> then I have this plant from Target. It is so cute. If you guys see these, just pick one up. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention. If you see something in my room that you like and it's not already, link just ask for it in the comments and I will most likely put it in my description and right here I just have some pictures of palm trees the vibe of my room is a Vegas beach vacation that's kind of what I was going for I have a chair actually I don't know why that was outside my room but it kind of looks like a casino chair I wanted to bring a little piece of home in this room this is where I keep my tripods just in front of my window um, I just got this one it's for my camera it's from the company that creates gorilla pod Joby this one's for my phone you can see it's kind of beat up but you know what it works I'm gonna use it to it literally falls to pieces because I love it so much. Dun, 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 dun. Okay, so this is obviously my favorite wall. So this side is the makeup side and that's the skincare, body care, hair care side. So I'm gonna start out with this side at the very top. I'm so short. <laughs> okay, let me get up here. I can't really see what's going on. I got this from Home Goods. This kind of ties in like the beach theme. These are actually from Ikea and they're like outdoor bases and I put these little LED lights on the inside. So this is where the battery goes and you can just turn it on and off. Did a TikTok on this recently it's my blinked out windex bottle that's just a pr box that is really cute and then a room spray and a morphe palette because i'm obsessed on the next shelf the one i can reach i keep my makeup brushes i keep them in this container that has a lid i found these off of amazon i keep the bigger brushes in this one and then the smaller eye brushes in this one so this is a little necklace that i got when i was in esthetician school in the back i just have a plant from home goods i got this from the target dollar spot it was like three bucks super cute this was one of my 3 a.m. purchases. It just says honey. It's a little honey pot. Honey boba bear. <laughs> Anyways, let's move on to this drawer. If you're in the mood to buy anything, these lashes right here. I obviously stocked up. This is where I keep my lashes and my lippies. Bought these little like container things at Home Goods. I use it for my lashes. This is a lipstick holder where I just keep my Too Faced lip glosses in here. In the next drawer, I keep you know, just more makeup. I got these containers at Target. They're like the frosted containers, which I love. So I got two big ones, one on each side, and then the small ones in the middle. <laughs> okay. Just wait so I can grab the camera. 
Okay, <laughs> so, um, so this is where I keep my face palettes. These are just palettes that have kind of like an all-in-one thing, like blush, bronzer in it. And I also have some like Morphe ones. In the next container, these have all my bronzers. My favorite one is this one. I don't know, it's just so good. Well, I have a lot of favorite ones, but it smells amazing like you're on vacation. Like Cover Fix, just some random makeup brands. I don't even know. We have some Too Faced. This one's pretty good too. This is my blush container. I this is a PR. It's actually really cute and it smells amazing. This next one has all of my highlighters. I even have like a body highlighter, which which is really cool. This is a really good one, especially if you're doing like a no makeup makeup day. This Becca highlighter is so good. This just has all of my cream and liquid blushes and bronzer. Here I have translucent powder and then I have baking powders in this one. In the back, this is where I keep my most used lip products. I have Morphe lip glosses. This smells so good. It's amazing. It's the Sour Patch one by Morphe. Super good. I'm out of breath. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I need to take a break. My favorite lip gloss right now is the one by Kapari. It is the watermelon scented one. Oh my gosh, it is so good. In the back here, I just keep extra brushes. When I do like crazy makeup looks, these are the brushes that I use. This is my favorite drawer. This is where I keep all of my palettes and it's the messiest drawer out of everything here. I have ColourPop in the back. I have Pretty Vulgar, Madison Beer. Collected a lot of palettes from BoxyCharm. Those are mainly in the back, but honestly, they're really good quality, so I'm not mad at it. I don't know, if you guys watch Quartz, chaos i literally love her we did a swap and she gave me this like hamburger palette it is the cutest thing i don't think courtney watches my stuff but if you are thank you so much for that because it is literally so fun i actually really love doing makeup but i don't really show it i used to do like a few tiktoks here and there of me doing like transformations with makeup but then i don't know i just get scared when i'm bored i'll do like cute makeup looks and then just like take it off but I don't know, maybe I will start a makeup TikTok. And on the bottom, this is where I keep all of my foundations, concealers, BB creams, and this is where I keep some jewels and stuff that I do for my face when I do fun makeup. And this is full coverage foundations right there. And then on the left here, I have my BB creams, I have my concealers. I have a lot, but the only reason I have a lot is because I've tried to find like the perfect concealer and I still, haven't. The only one that's come close is the Pretty Vulgar one. I use the shade Undercover and I also really like the Morphe shades. I think I use the Alt, whatever this one is. This one is the Camo Concealer in the color Medium Neutral. This one's pretty good too. I actually like this one. It's super buttery. That's why I like it. And here I just have some lightweight foundations. This one is actually like a no pigmented foundation, which really is just a primer. It's honestly just a primer, so don't waste your money. In the last little corner, this is where I keep my everyday makeup. So what I do when I'm getting ready is I will just come to this drawer. Don't spend too much time on my favorite makeup right now. Maybe I'll do a separate video if you guys want. Just let me know in the comments. But in this next drawer, in the back I just have some neon colored liners. I have my lash tools that I use and then some lip liners in the back. These are primers, these are primers. Look how cute this is. This is another one of my 3 a.m. purchases. I will never be opening this. It's gonna stay like this, but they're little beauty sponges. So cute. And then back here is where I keep my brush cleaners and sponge cleaners, but I have them out because I'm going to be cleaning. And then this is where I keep my setting sprays. Mascaras, eyeliners, this is like false lashes, magnetic lash glue. I have some brow pomades in the back and this is my brow stuff. These are my primers. The bottom drawer is so random. So I have like bags and jewelry, which it's like Forever 21 jewelry. It's not even like, I don't own any fancy jewelry. Finally on the last drawer. So this is like my workout drawer it's so random it's like makeup and then workout this mystery mermaid waistband is so good i'll have to link it because it really makes you sweat and then i just have more bands and then my workout bag but it's like a week later <laughs> anyways maybe i should turn on some lights oh let me show you how my lighting works here's my door again you walk in and i have this like remote control thing and so you can just take it off and turn the lights on with the button there's different like modes i just stick it back on usually i don't even take it off i just press the on and off button and then this doesn't really work let me show you my led lights so this is the controller i use and i kind of have to point it over here in this corner my favorite setting is the purple one diy three anyways so that turns on the led lights around my closet all around here and i know what you guys are gonna say i should probably put these behind here but i kind of like them exposed put them around my mirror as well so at nighttime it looks so good what's holding my mirror is this thing from ikea i actually got this at the as is section it's i don't know what the heck it is i wanted my mirror to be like lifted up because i don't know why but i can just see myself better okay so next to my mirror i have the skincare section i'm so excited to show you this so the first thing i have up here is just this beach themed like lamp i 
cut off some of those and I put one in here because I thought it would be cute, you know? And it's the same thing that's over there. And then I have my TikTok skateboard, which let me take it down for you. So TikTok sent me a skateboard and I don't know, it's just so cute. Like this is my, I love the iridescent look. But anyways, it's a little skateboard. It doesn't come with wheels or anything. It's meant to just be put on your wall, which I haven't gotten a chance to put it on my wall. Maybe you guys can tell me where I should put it because I really don't know. I was thinking up there. I literally thought I was recording. So I was like talking to myself this whole time. Okay, anyways, shelf is full of random stuff. So that lamp is the same one that's over there on the top shelf. And I found this at Home Goods. It used to be a soap thing, but I took the soap pump out. I think it looks cute. Um, so this. <laughs> Dang it. it. used to say Babe Cave, now it says Abe Cave. I just keep some bath bombs in here. I love Lush, so I just kind of keep them up top, easy to reach. In the first drawer, I keep all of my cleansers, toners, and exfoliators, moisturizers, masks, <laughs> moisturizers, masks, 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 masks. If you guys want me to go in depth with my skincare routine, cause this is just like a tour, I can. Just let me know if you guys want one. Here are some more masks. And then I keep little fortune cookies in here. And then more moisturizers there. That's all I have in this drawer. So I'm gonna close that now. And then we're gonna move on to the next drawer. Then I have three rows of vitamin C serums. And then right here, I just have some peels, dark spot corrector serums. And then this is my retinol row. So I have three retinols. Here I have my eye creams, I have some random ones. Back here, I just have some random serums that don't really have a category. And then down here, I call this like my body skincare drawer. I have my sugar scrubs. This one is so, so good for the holidays. Like, I don't know, it just puts me in the mood. I love anything candy cane scented. And here I keep all of my lotions. These are the ones I've been loving. And over here I have some body serums. This is really cool. So you take your regular lotion and then you drop like a few drops of this in it and it just helps moisturize your skin a lot more. This is my makeup removing bin. And then right here I just have my like face oils and I have my, I don't know how to say it, but I have these things. And then some face rollers. This is one of my favorite lip oils. It's just so good. I don't know what it is about it, but it leaves your lips feeling so buttery. I got these acrylic holders from Home Goods. I just keep some reusable cotton pads in there and these are little toner puffs. And then yeah, that's basically this drawer. Not too bad. This drawer, oh my gosh. This is a mess. This, is, this drawer is too much. I wanna declutter all of my stuff. I have all of my favorite <laughs> hair care stuff. This stuff, throw away whatever heat spray you're using and go buy this. It will change your life. It'll change your hair life. That's basically that drawer. In this drawer, I have more of my hair care items. So in this bucket, I just keep my hair tools Then I keep my brushes. So I just keep hair ties in this one and then hair clips in this one. The last drawer, this is my tech drawer. Here I just keep some random cables. Honestly, don't even know what any of these do. Then I have a phone stand. I love this thing, by the way. Really helps with my TikToks. And then this random thing. I have a mini ring light, which I will be using soon. And then this light I bought off Amazon. It kind of like makes your background look colorful. It's dead right now, but it has so many colors you can choose from. Mini tripods, random stuff here. And then this is my very first microphone ever. And that's about it. We can move on to the closet now. Oh my gosh. I feel like I've been doing this for like Ever. So I got my nails done. If you guys want to see them, you know, you know, you know. So cute. I love them. These are probably my favorite nails I've gotten done. Well, this is, this is my closet. Welcome to my closet. What's really cool about my closet is I hung these things up, just press on them and they're little lights. On the next shelf, I have a towel warmer and a wax warmer and this mini refrigerator for my skincare that I don't use anymore. Below that, I have a train case, which keeps all of my esthetician stuff when I'm on the go, but that plan totally failed. I literally went to esthetician school. Ever since social media started, I just, that idea was just pushed under the rug and now I'm here doing this. So I'm happier now than I ever was before. So I'm super excited. So that's just chilling there. Then I have some yoga mats. So then right here, I just keep some disposable items. So I got these white bins from Target. And so inside them, I just have some waxing stuff. So I have some popsicle sticks, spoolies in this one, under eye masks for this one, dental bibs. So when I'm doing a service on myself, I just kind of lay out the dental bib and then lay all my disposables on this. And here I have disposable cotton pads, applicators, and cotton swabs. And this one, I just have more waxing items. I'm afraid to show you what's in these drawers because they're kind of like 
messy. This is where I keep my microneedling pen and my high frequency. I'm not gonna show that one because this has a bunch of random stuff in it. This one, I keep all my waxing stuff in here. Lash extension drawer. I have my magnifying glasses. I have some tint stuff. This drawer, just random stuff I need to put away. And then this drawer is more disposable items, which I'm trying to get through. Okay, so on the top shelf, I keep a plant that I got from Home Goods. This one is from Target. Then I have my Ariana Grande Cloud Perfume. This one smells so good. I get the most compliments using this one. Anytime I want to sample a perfume, I'll just put the sampler bottle in here and it kind of looks cute. And then I just have some trash. On the second one, I have some cotton swabs and this holds my like makeup towels. There's that. And then on the top shelf, I keep my sanitizing items in here. So I have some Barbicide, Barbicide wipes. And then in this one, I have hair tinsels. And back here is where I keep my camera bags. This is my nail cart and I did a few TikToks on this. I'll actually post some shorts on this as well so you can see how I built this. But basically I just keep my gel polishes up here. These are little like sample colors of all these nail polishes. This whole nail cart is on Amazon so I will go ahead and link that on my Amazon page. I have my nail lamp, a nail fan. Then I have my drill. This is literally the best drill. I love this one so much and this is kind of what it looks like. From the closet you go back to my door and then that is my room. I realize I have a lot of stuff. I need to declutter. Maybe that'll be the next video, me decluttering my room. Hi, it's Kelly from the future. It's like two or three weeks later. But anyways, I wanted to show you the mirror I was talking about at the beginning of the video. This is what it ended up looking like. It's a cute blog mirror. Is it Hagrid? I look like Hagrid from Harry Potter right now. I just woke up, kind of. I didn't, okay, I'm lying. I didn't just wake up, but I did just get out of bed. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you so much for watching. Oh my gosh, I only have one nail left. <laughs> Bye.